Hello everyone, Yui here, back with another collection video, this time the Fusion Bakugan. After I finished putting away all the Armor Alliance ones, and I got the main big bucket there as a kind of blockage so they don't roll off the table. So yeah, and we got Big Boy over there, which we will get into when we get there. So let's start out with... Dragotret, Darkus, Pyrus, Dragotret, and I did not grab the character cards, so no character cards for this video either. Okay. And as you can see, 300B. Lovely looking Dragotret. And, you know, as we all like to do, since he has these bags in his hands, this is a hold up. Uh, uh, had to, at least once. Okay, and I'm gonna do these a little different since there's no rhyme or reason to fusions, anyways. But I totally did not show the uh, ball form. I just went right into it. Chaos Pyrus, Drago Trats. Really love the colors. Just since I already rolled it. There you go. And this one is 600B. There's those two. And now the last Drago Tret. Ventus Chaos Drago Tret. Uh, yes. Wait, no. There we go. There we go. Funny, because all three of these have magic shields. But Ventus Chaos. Yeah. The other two. 600B. Drago Party. Okay, let's do the Pegagillas next. Pegatrix, Skeletor, and Pyrus and Chaos. There we go. Fix cores. Pegagilla. <laughs> okay, and I know I'm kind of going back on my word in the previous video. I'm just going to pull these out now so I don't have to dig for them later. There we go. But part of the Target Exclusive 2-pack Arlis Chaos Pegatrix, which honestly I love this design better than the normal Chaos Arlis. But that's just my personal bias. And I'm Again, it looks so good. Opened up. All that nice gold. Yeah, these little bits that I showed before came with, or that I talked about before in the previous collection video, came with this one. And there you go. <laughs> Obviously, you can put this on any of them or the normal. Pegatrix Ultra. But yeah. And then Darkus Aquas Pegatrix Skeletor. Oh, right. 400B and 400B. Derp. And 600. The Darkus and Aquas fusions look really nice, honestly. Okay, with the other two. So there's all the Pegatrix Skeletors. Now, let's see, what do I have more of? Uh, here's a real quick one. There's only two for these. Hydrus Batrix, Ventus and Aquas. Another fusion combination that looks nice. It's cool that we're getting more dual faction cards with Geoguns. 
like the different combinations of factions, but it would be nice if the fusions continued. But sadly, they do not. But here's Idris Batrix. Kind of always looks a little funny. But, uh, Darkus, Aquas, Batrix. Hey, not bad for never really rolling Hydras Batrix before. And there's those two together. Oh, right, right. 700B on this one. And 300 on this one, but it has a core effect. I don't think this one does. I don't remember. But yeah. Okay, now let's get into the Trox Cyruses. Here's Chaos Ventus Trox Cyrus. I really love the design. Try not to go too long on this, just for the sake of the camera battery. But it shouldn't be that bad. Here's Trox Cyrus 500B. Kind of looks like a skull. <laughs> okay. Mm, let's see, where's another Trox Iris? No, not you. I want, don't want this to last long and I got other guns trying to flip and pop open when it's not their time yet. <sighs> but, uh, ha, ha, there's one. Arliss Ventus Trox Iris. Again, still really like the design. Big fat magnet. Can double core because of the big fat magnet. Right. Here is the Ventus Harless. Uh, 100B. Don't remember if it has a core effect or not. Okay. Uh, Darkest Pyrus Truck Cyrus. The exclusive, we designed one from the Unbox and Brawl pack. Because the normal one is. Like opposite colors. So much they did that with the Drago Trap, but no, the one you get in the four pack looks like that also. But yeah, 500B. Truck Cyrus. And there they all are. Okay. Let's move on to the Halcors X Ramparians. Yeah, I think it's just this four. Uh, yes. Okay. Aquas Darkus Halcor Ramparian. And there it goes. Yeah, I kind of helped it out of habit, but the feet on mine just kind of stopped there. They need an extra push for going out the rest of the way. Uh, there we go, 500B. Long tail. <sighs> okay, the uh, Arliss Darkest part of the other part of the two pack of this peg of Gila. Halcor Ramparian. Bump the camera again. Okay, there's that one. Uh, 500B. little gear pieces on there. Yeah, these two were the two pack. Came with promo uh, Baku Strength and promo uh, the Darkest Destroyers. That's it. But yeah, those two go together. And then Chaos Ventus Ramparian Halcor. Whoa. Okay, if I miss, I'm just gonna pop open. There's that. 400B. Okay, and the. I really did not. Oh, it's still opened. Darkest Pyrus Halcor Ramparian. Mind this mill bit likes to loosely move 700B. 
And there's all the turtle dragon puppers together. Okay. Let's see, there's still cores before we move on to the ultras. Fangtanoid. Aquas, Ventus, Fangzor, Mantanoid. Fangtanoid. And Fangtanoid. I love Fangtanoid. 600B. Love that design. Definitely one of my favorite fusions. Okay, and then Aquas Arlis, Fangtanoid. Let's see, can I spin roll? Yes and no. I'm not even going to try and redo that. But 400B. That shiny gold and silver. The two Fangtanoids together. I really need more Fangtanoids. How many times can I say Fangtanoid? At least this pile is going to be smaller. Okay. Uh, let's see. Core. Trox Nobilius. Ventus Arlis. Which, if you've seen the anime, you know it's not actually Nobilius. It's an entirely different Bakugan with a different name. Same with uh, Halcor Serpentis. But, 300B. Old derpy. Derpy core. But hey. This one and the Arliss Aquas Core Hydras Trino are available in a Walmart exclusive 2-pack that comes with the... Uh, Arliss Ventus, Troxyrus, and the Arliss Aquas Fangtanoid. I'll show all those together once we get Hydras open here. There we go. Sadly, my only Aquas Arliss Hydras Trino. But there's that four pack right there. Comes with a little frisbee mat. Here's it. Where's the B on you? I forget. Um, where is it? <laughs> oh, it's on the tail, that's right. 600. And it's a Trino. And I'm actually gonna close that up now because the big boy back there. Uh, let's see, core is left. Got Darkest, Darkest, Nilius Enoch. Because, as I said in the Rapid Fire Fusion deck, Magnus said, screw the rules I'm fusing to normal Darkest Factions. But, Nillinock. Love the design of Nilius Enoch. B is 500. Really love this design. Okay. Hydronoid Crackelius. Another fusion design I really like. And, whoop, there we go. Bump the camera. Of course. Okay. I really do like how they like reuse the heads of the normal core hydronoid for this. But hydronoid Carcalius. If there was a Chaos Darkest one, that would be amazing because it'd be like Sylvie fused Sylvie and Emma fused two of their Bakugan, which I mean it's what it is, but sadly the Darkest one is mixed with Aquas, not Chaos. Because Dark as Chaos didn't exist until Geogun Rising, and I cry. Okay, uh, three more cores. Uh, Darkus Pyrus Cindius Scorpros came in the same deck as the Nilinok here and the Arliss Hydrus. And I believe right now are only really available Scorpros Cindius. I think the shield here is about supposed to come out a bit more. But it just really goes up that far. And this is what I meant when I said in the Battle Planet video that they reused the same tail bit for this mold. But yeah. Cool looking fusion. I don't use it because the stats to me aren't could be better. Okay. Core uh Halcorex Serpentes. That comes with the uh Battle Calcium. May do a video on that, like a separate video. Just for fun. Nope. <laughs> there we go. I do like how, compared to the normal colors, these three are like a slightly different shade of the uh, 
usual green and blue. Like, compare those two, or that, or that black. I just really like it for that a little too far. But there's the core version of Halcor Serpentis, uh, 400B. Instead of looking over the camera, I should look at the screen. That That's smarter. Okay, and the last Fusion core, we got Garganoid X Webum, Pyrus and Darkus. No core effect, it did not land on a red shield. Oh no. <laughs> Get the hands out. Much easier than in that deck profile sorts of video, which this is no longer in that deck, as I stated in the Armored Alliance video. That one is going to be replaced or get Darkest Barbetra in it, so it'll be a full beehive. But yeah, Garganoid Webum. I love just because Garganoid. Uh, we get it, you love Garganoid. Shut up! Never! Alright. Pyrus, Arliss, Drago, Auxilator. Which I'm... Actually, you know what? No, I'll just roll it out and then roll it, uh, close it up for the big boy over there. There we go. Now, Spin Master said the first Bakugan with posable arms, but as we saw in the Legacy Collection video, that's not true. Because the Legacy Drago and uh, Colossus in the Darak has the little movie bits. But yeah. He has a Drago, and his arms move. Just kind of wish the wing design would be slightly better. 800B, shiny gold horn. We'll just close up real quick for the uh, big guy over there. Let's get that done. And I'll, thankfully, I've closed this enough times I can do it quickly. I say as I am still ever so slightly struggling with getting him closed. There we go. Okay, now Hedris Drano and Pyrus Arliss, the one that came with the uh, Unbox and Brawl pack from Amazon. Okay. Okay. This is fine. <laughs> this is fine. There he goes. It's like, I'm just gonna keep turning him and slightly messing with him until he fully opens. Alright, there you go. Still need to get the normal one. Same with the uh, Pegatrix scoring here that goes with it. Because, I mean, yeah, this looks cool, but eh. There's not enough shiny Aurelis on it to really make me love it. But it is... What is that? 400B. Hidden back there on the hind leg. Yeah, it's a Drano. I already closed this up, but... Just a uh, comparison between the two. Between the core and the ultra. Close up the core again, but at least it's a core, so it's easy. Okay, now the other Arliss Darkest Hydra's Trino. The other Hydra's Trino is what I was trying to say, but my brain no work. My rolls no work either. Oh, well, that was better. Didn't flip, but it's still better. Look at that shiny gold. Oh, I love the shiny gold. Admittedly, the gold on Drago Auxilator isn't as uh, shiny as, like, say, this gold. But still good. And 400B also on this one. And compare just between the two. How they look. Yeah, this should be basically like this of... Pyrus all over, and then the gold's there, but hey, what are you going to do? Now, I mostly bought this three-pack for the Hey Ass Barbetra. <laughs> no regrets. Okay, let's do Pegagorine because I love Hey Ass, Arliss, Pegatrix Gorine. This was in the Mono Hey Ass deck at one point in time, but got taken out for the plant. Uh, there she is, 700B. Nice big beefy pony. And then Aquasarlus Pegagorine. And there, that's a good stand. 
There's those two together. And now for the Ventus Arlis. Mine has issues, as you can see. Picatrix boring. Okay. There we go. There's that one. See how it is with its box exclusive mate there. Oh yeah, the Aquas one is 400B. I didn't realize it was upside down. And this one is crap. 700B, also upside down. But there are the Pegagorines all there. And close up the Aquas one, or not Aquas, the Chaos one. Which is, I honestly find it funny because I got this off of Amazon for Cuckoo Toys like long before she started appearing in uh, Walmarts and such. Okay, Halcor Serpentis, Darkest Arlis, the Ultra. Mm -hmm. One time I did this, I can't seem to replicate it. Maybe I need to roll it faster. But I got to just open up and just like that. Almost like Anelius. And it was amazing. But Flying Doggo. Uh, 700B. Let's see, where was the core? Yeah, at least this is easier to dig through. And there was the core version. See how those look together. get the, this closed up for the big boy and I'm going to pause but when I get to that just to double check what goes where okay uh, Arlis Ventus Trox Cyrus not Trox Cyrus Trox Nobilius did I even say Serpentis on Hellcore? I don't know Okay, one more try. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Could have been better. We'll try again with the uh, Aquas one. There you go. Uh, 500B. Kind of got that Lumino uh, Drago 5 going there. And with the core version. And again, you can see the difference in that coloring. Put it there. Aquas Arlis. Drago Nobilius. Not Drago Trox. Ay, ay, ay. I'm not losing my momentum. I'm just slurring my words. I'm not even drunk. I don't even drink. Go away. Here is the Aquas Arlis one. 600B. Let's see how those two look together. Okay, now I'll close up trucks here, and that will be all the pieces for uh, the big boy back there done. But we'll get through the rest of what's in the bucket first. And next we have Darkus Arlis Sabra Pyravian. Which I have not seen in the anime yet because I'm watching on Cartoon Network, and there's still a couple episodes behind. But hey, let's get that. Hey, almost. Good. Sabra Pyravian. Got Pyravian's head in the middle and a nice shiny gold. Mm -hmm. B, there it is. 400. Now for my first Sabra Pyravian, the Pyrus Arliss. Uh, variety. Mm. Oh yeah, before I roll out, mine has this awkward paint mishap where the Arla symbol did not quite make the circle for the uh, fashion symbol, but oh well. Just like, compare to that. And another misprint uh, we'll get to in a second. A different Bakugan. Oh, it wanted it. Well, it got it, it just didn't stand. Uh, there's the Pyrus one with another shiny Pyravian head. See how those two look together. And this one 
has gear. Bring in the big guns that we gave Drago Tret earlier. Peg on these bits. I honestly want to see how this gear looks in the uh, anime, especially since you got these like big, huge guns on the side. Let's see if this actually wants to open. It did, I just did it the wrong way. Oopsies. But you got like this face cannon here. This kind of just hangs down a bit from the weight, but oh well. Of course you can put it on the darkest one. But yeah. And in hindsight I should have shown these gear pieces off with uh, those, but oh well. Okay, Pyrus Arliss uh, Feral Guild Tour, or essentially Ultra Feral. And this is what I was talking about. It's the Pyrus, as you can see. Pyrus. But for some reason, it has the Ventus symbol. <laughs> okay. There we go. Start speeding up because the camera battery is going lower. There's in the open mode, uh, 400B. And then the Chaos Arliss uh, Ultra Feral, Feral Guild Tour. There we go. Okay, and if you can hear that, I'm sorry, my mom makes weird noises in her sleep. 200B. Yeah, for some reason the Chaos one, the head doesn't go down all the way. It <laughs> but yeah, two Ultra Ferals, essentially. They're different socks. But this one has gear. So let's get those uh, plugged in. I still feel like they should be opposite, but this is how the box shows them. And there we go. I think this is supposed to be our Rulian Accelerator. Now that I think about it. But, yeah. There's that. I do love that the uh, Fusion Gears actually have their dual symbols on them. Like, you got Arliss there and the Chaos symbol. And then on this one, Arliss there and Pyrus. So, okay. Now we are going to stop. I'm going to double check that thing. And we'll be right back. Okay, I double checked, so now let's do this. Get some Dragonoid Infinity up in here. Bring down the tail. And just because I know my memory is shit, I have the photo open. Okay, Arliss Ventus Trox, Arliss Aquas Hydrus Trino, and Core. And just to make sure, yep. Chaos Arliss Pegatrix scoring. And again, I have not seen this in the anime yet. Darkest Arliss uh, Serpentees Halcor. I had to think for a second. And then Arliss Pyrus Trox, not Trox, Ar Zildtor Drago. And I'm going to bring the camera up. There we go. Now these bits can be separated into their own separate gear pieces for each figure. I may show that real quick after this. But give him his Dragonoid Infinity the gears. Come on. I'm trying to do this before the camera dies. But this usually gives me trouble, so. Come on, there we go. It's like it just does not want to go in that hole. And then the shield. Oh, now I, was, I sadly did not get Dragonoid uh, Maximus and Battle Planet. I did make sure to pick up Infinity Drago. And look at that. It's just so gorgeous, honestly. Like the gold on the toes, the gold on the tail. He is posable. And he can launch. We'll show that in a sec. Here you can see the Bakugan back there. But yeah, 
It's interesting because it looks like the mouth should open, but no matter how hard I try, it just doesn't. Okay, and you can kind of just place this back here with all the uh, bits attached to it as a uh, sort of extra gear for uh, Drago Infinity. But let's... Okay, I'm going to stand up for this part real quick because this is probably going to fail. We'll move the cores forward and Bakugan bro. <laughs> well, that wasn't perfect, but it worked. Okay, so I'm just going to pause this because the camera battery is low and set everyone up with their uh, extra gear pieces. So I'll be right back. All right, and here we have everyone all geared up with the uh, bits from the shield and sword. Now, these all have their own separate release cards. These two cards come with Drago Infinity, but also that uh, Walmart 4-pack. The Halcor uh, Darkest Arliss gear card comes with uh, the arena that the core comes with. Destroyers comes with Dragonoid Infinity, of course. The only one we have not seen, unfortunately, is the Chaos Arliss one with these big fat guns. <laughs> I love that Pegatrix just has huge guns. So yeah, and again, you can like connect these in different combinations. In fact, I'm gonna pause one more time and do one more combination. Okay, and here is just one of the many crazy combinations you can do with these. Like you can also take like these tiny bits up here, peg them in to that part, or unpeg these parts and throw those on up here. So turn, whoops, that did not go on the peg. Gosh darn it. There we go. Turn these around. Uh, like so that and as I said before you can <coughs> take this whole bit and essentially give it to Dragonoid Infinity so yeah let's get that last shot up in here, get all the important fusions really, really fast, because again, I don't know how long this camera battery is going to last, because it is pretty low. Drago Tret, Fangzor, uh, Halcor, I think that's all of them. Oh, nope. <laughs> As usual, I think that's all, but there isn't. Okay. Uh, no, because that in the show is chaos and uh, Arliss. Or not chaos, chaos and Pyrus. Alright. So, there's that for the fusion video. Hope y'all enjoyed. Sorry, this seemed a bit rushed. I was fighting with camera battery. But, um, if y'all enjoyed, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, or just do it anyways. Check out all the links in the description below. Check out my Bakugan videos place set. Maybe there's a video you possibly missed. But I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye! Fix the, fix your arm. Fix your arm. Okay, bye! <laughs> Whoop.